Welcome back guys, thanks for joining me for another beer review. Let me just get myself comfy. Uh, right, we are back with something sort of a little bit different. It's a beer that I picked up from Chatapolsky or Chatapolska, uh, the Wrexham store. Uh, and it's a Polish beer, obviously, if I'm picking it up from a Polish shop. Put your teeth in, Baz. Uh, and it's an alcohol-free one as well. So what we're looking at is a 0% beer, and this is Tyski's version. So it's Tyski 0%, it's in a 500ml can coming in at 0% and I think this cost me about £1.49, something like that, I could be wrong. Uh, but yeah, the original Tyski, I do, I do quite like that, I think that's quite decent, uh, certainly drinkable enough. Uh, I like the can, clearly all this alcohol free stuff tends to come in sort of like, seems to be either green or blue cans doesn't it, it's this thing isn't it. Uh, so yeah, now I don't have a Tyski glass, but I'm going to bang it in my Sargres glass. Picked that up for £1.49 in the charity shop and I just fancy using it because I haven't used it yet. So, let's get this cracked open and see what we get. Now, I reviewed Tyski a long time ago, a long time ago, and it's not one that I go back and, as I've said many times, because I'm always doing these beer reviews and that, a lot of the beers I don't tend to revisit just because I'm always trying new ones. Uh, but I did drink a normal Thai ski in Bridge North the other week when I went to uh, Weather Spoons. We went up there for the, a darts exhibition. So we sat in there, had a bite to eat, and I did have one in there. And it reminded me then, God knows what my review said, I can't remember to be honest, but it reminded me a bit like a Stella, but how Stella used to be a long time ago. Uh, but, you know, correct me if I'm wrong, maybe I was just, maybe that was just me then, I don't know. But, we are going to, we are going to take a look at this one, and I'm going to, I'm going to try and review it normally, but if it does remind me of sort of, a 0% sort of stellar sort of thing, well, I will mention it. Anyway, beer in a glass, uh, the head looks like it's sort of going a bit funny, you know, when it, does that big bubble head and the head sort of disappears. It looks a little bit like that. Uh, there's plenty of bubbles going up as you can see. It's typical sort of lager looking. It does look a little bit light, shall we say, if that makes any sense. Sometimes beers can look a little bit light and I don't mean in colour, it just sort of looks light. Anyway, let's give it a swirl, dive in on the nose and see what we get out of it now. Yeah, it, it smells shandy-like to a certain extent. It's got that sweetness, sugary, shandy kind of feel to it. it it's uh, almost got that lemonade thing in there. Yeah, that's all it smells like. It does smell like a shandy. And that's all I can get. So, top it up. Let's dive in on Tyski 0%. Cheers. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> that's a little bit weird, that is, yeah. It's... Let's go in again. Yeah. That's weird. In all fairness, do you know what? I I said it looks a little bit light and what have you. And yeah, I've had to sort of like build the head up a little bit. But when you drink it, it actually has quite a decent body on it. It does feel quite weighty. It's relatively smooth in all fairness, even though there's a lot of carbonation in there. It's still pretty smooth to drink. Reasonably sort of soft in the mouth. Taste wise, it's, it's, it's a bit weird.
it tastes like shandy just tastes like a shandy but on sort of like behind that say halfway through your mouthful a few seconds after drinking it you get a nasty sort of bitterness I'm gonna say it's, it leaves your mouth with a nasty bitterness yeah that first second or so it's not bad when your palate adjusts you get that sort of maltiness but behind that it leaves a nasty taste in your mouth to me it just tastes like a shandy there's not really a lot else going on with it i wouldn't say you pick up you maybe pick up a little bit of a citrus note in there which I think you've you noticed more after the beer has gone it might be that citrus note that leaves a harsh bitterness maybe it's almost yeah yeah I think that sort of harsh sort of bitterness is, is there but it's added to at the end of the mouthful with the citrus note. I don't think this is very good myself. Uh, it's like drinking a shandy with a nasty finish to it. Uh, so for me, the Taiski 0%, I won't be drinking that again. Uh, that really isn't very nice. Uh, if you're gonna have a beer, if you get all, if you're gonna have something alcohol free, don't have this, find something better or just have Coke. If you want a Taiski, don't go for this. Don't go for this one. Uh, go for the full fat one. Much better. Yeah. So there you are. There are my views on this beer. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Ooh, gas revenge. Uh, yeah. That's it for this beer review. Not keen on it myself. If you've had it before, let me know what you think. Feel free to comment. Thank you all for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. And I'll see you again soon on another one. Cheers.